Good afternoon from Pioneer's Banker Plant area. Uh, we got peppers, purple flash peppers, and we got lobularia, mainly as host plants for aureus. We buy in aureus and uh, they feed on the pollen of the pepper and lobularia plants. And we'll show you later how they're hanging up in the greenhouse. And basically we're using these for trips control. Um, one aureus can eat 70 or 80 trips a day. So um, we get good mileage out of having to buy in some aureus. And in conjunction with nematode applications, we, um, we basically don't have a drips problem in the greenhouse and we can say that we haven't had for the last X number of years. And it's really cheap and effective control and we don't have to spray nasty chemicals and it's good for the environment and good for our employees, good for the customers. So in addition to the pepper plants and lobularia, we also have some uh, aphid baker plants that we have growing on dry and we've got some uh, bean indicator plants. So on these uh, aphid bankers here, we have some acetylloides breeding. So we're finding a, a larvae of acetylloides, which basically have a toxin that kills the aphids. Uh, in addition to that, some of the bankers that you'll see hanging up to at our greenhouse, we'll get to, uh, some videos on those. Those will parasitize the aphid and they will emerge from the mummified aphid and fly around the greenhouse and find the rest of them. These aphids will only grow on monocots, that's why we have them on the rye. And then these bean plants we use as indicators. So we put these out basically anywhere we think we might have some spider mite issues and the spider mites will be attracted to the beans and they'll basically crawl across the crop and you'll see them pretty much right away as soon as you have them on the bean. And we'll know right away that we have to do something to treat for the spider mites. Excuse me Amanda. We've got some lobularia 50 cell trays available for sale and also some 50 cell peppers. We've grown these under LED lights and uh, it's saved this growth regulator. It's given us a whole lot bigger, belt, better, bulkier plants and we've got our um, six inch pepper plants as well which we're going to turn around and plant into larger pots and uh, one thing I like to see is a good white root system which shows that basically the plant is healthy. So healthy plant means uh, good, good for the customers and also happy growers. <laughs> Thank you very much. Hope it was informative. <laughs> So above us here, and running the length of the greenhouse, we have some lobularia banker plants. These are what Roger was talking about having uh, aureus on that will go after any trips that we have in the greenhouse. Back down at the front of the greenhouse, we have the aphid banker plants hanging up. And pretty soon, once we can get aureus introduced to our peppers, we'll have the peppers in amongst all the lobularia going the length of the greenhouse.